Alright, here we are at the start of Act 4, Part 2, The Fall of Aelund. We managed to recover from our execution, we explored the capital of Murfell, managed to convince the king to help get some mercenaries to stage an attack, and during that attack, which is just a diversion, we sneak into the castle and uh, take out the king, but we need to find the Scepter of the Ages first to disable his armor, so that is our goal. Greetings and well met. <laughs> But let's get into Lisa and uh, Creosa back into the party. Well met. Also, I had a thought. We should really swap this necklace, which has the death magic immunity and disease immunity, and give that to Creosa, because she has less fort save. And uh, Nelise is immune to disease anyway, being a paladin. Divine health, see? So Nelise has a will save of 26 versus, like, fear, and she's immune to fear as well, and fortitude 21. So Krios is a lot more vulnerable to that, so we want to give her the immunity to the death magic. Okay, and I don't know what their spells are like, so we're gonna rest. <laughs> and then we'll go see what Robert Black in this century you're up to. Yes. What is it? See, halt and be identified, that's so much better than saying who dares approach. Greetings to you. I greet my greetings to you. My greetings to my greetings to you. My greetings my greetings to you. My greetings to you. I greet my greetings to you. Welcome. Welcome. Well, well, welcome. Oh, looks like that's just the same. Welcome. Oh, uh huh. Never seen this conversation before, ever. <laughs> bonjour, 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 bonjour. Hello. My greetings to you. Mithril Buckler, that's five shield AC. Chevalier shield, that would be good. Gloves of Thunder and Force. Nelly should already have that hood. Nothing else here is anything we care about. Dwarven War Axe, we're not going to be using that, and it's only plus three longsword, plus four. Mighty Crossbow to Speed. It wouldn't be terrible to give to Nelly, but we don't really need it right now. And Natural Armor Amulet, plus five. Ooh, that lesser ring of regeneration is something we're gonna want. It's one more regen than what we have right now. There were no gloves that we use. No, okay. Uh, I have no real good base in comparison, so I'm just gonna say we have no one else better to sell to, and it'll give us 20,000 gold, so we're just gonna 
I'm just gonna do it 5,000. Oh, these sell for quite a bit though. And he doesn't have enough money to buy more. Okay, so that gives her 23 potions of heal now. Gives her 23 potions of heal, and I have a bunch myself, and he can't really afford to buy much more. Alright, he's out of money again. So we're gonna have to sell a lot of this stuff later on. Oh well. We have a fair chunk of heal potions though, so that's all great. Hello. Alright, let's meet this general. Well met. Hello. The officers or anything new welcome, to say? Wel wel welcome. 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 All right. Hello, General Sir Gabriel well Dukinesque. So he knows her on sight. Interesting. Well, I guess she was engaged to Ostrich a few years ago, right? So. So, you, you know, oh, that's the graphical glitch right there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so she kind of has the most AC of any of us right now. I, I'm least worried about her. Her HP is just fine as well. Oh, he's not going to take well to this mercenaries thing. <laughs> he's saying this right in front of Robert. Oh, look at that. Oh boy, Braxford. Oh, 
Wow, that's not that's not very much, not against me. Finish him. I mean, one or two heal spells from a cleric or a few potions, he'd be right as rain. But I'm the former Baron, gosh. Oh boy. Deep caverns like where those vampires were. Wouldn't that is that the same mercenary company that Carthage came from back in Act Three? No, oh, so we're going underneath where the vampires were going to what the vampires were fighting. Oh boy. As rested as and equipped as will be. Would be nice to get her get her a cloak though, right? Battle of Braxford. Also, before I forget. Gen plus two. Quaint village. Yes, here's where we started a long time ago, and now we're having to fight our way through the town that we saved twice. Dante. Oh boy. I really don't want to have to kill Dante and Mona. Incidentally, I uh, remember how I mentioned earlier that I really wanted that epic skill focus persuade. That I don't like the fact that right now my persuade isn't even like average, which would be 30 at this level. Yeah, um, this is the thing I was hoping to persuade. But you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna let the Lord of Fate, the random number generator, decide. If we pass the necessary persuade checks, we'll avoid the fight. If we fail, it will do what we need to do. Let uh, let the dice gods determine the result.
this, this is gonna what we're, this is what we're gonna have to do. And I think I think Creosa's uh, armor couldn't be a uh, weapon couldn't be enhanced, right? That's what we discovered last time. That it, it's too powerful for flame weapon to work on it for whatever reason that means. It's got its plus five weapon or something. Yeah. Okay. Well met. Hello. Here we go. I thought he'd say something as I approached. Oh, there's a trigger. Where he's there we go. Don't shoot. Let them approach. Somehow I didn't trigger that. I don't know how. So we have rangers. Greetings to you. Greetings, greetings to you. Greetings to you. Greetings to you. <laughs> By the way, I hate you now. Cross your fingers. Yeah. Hello. Celeste and Mona and Dante. Why would you call madness? I call insanity. I'd really just be content with you letting us pass, really, I, that would be just okay. Whew, okay, we did the first one. Stand aside and let us end the stupid war once and for all. Whew. You, you, you know I'm investing in it when I'm willing to give up like the loot that these people have, especially like Celeste's full plate with haste that would be amazing for Nelise, for the sake of not having to kill Dante and Mona. Cache of equipment leaving behind inside the inn. Okay. Can I t talk to anyone else before they... Oh. Um. Well, that's good. Right? That is excellent. But I'm going to go... I'm going to save the game right here. So I want to actually talk to other people first, because I forgot to do that. Apparently. But we did successfully persuade them. We have that. We got it. First try. No tricks. No tricks. No tricksy hoppets.
Greetings, friend. Wow, she's uh, different from back when she was in Coldenay at level like 5 when we met her. Okay, so I'm not the only one thinking that. Nothing but death, huh? So, look, we didn't get any XP, or look, doesn't look like we set any particular plot triggers, so we can always reload to the other save, which we legitimately did the first time. Yeah. Hello. But we made it the second time, okay. Because usually in modules like this, and I can check and see if Alien is, is different, and that would be wonderful it is, usually they basically say, oh, you're, you know, they say, they take your current level and they figure out what would be a medium per difficulty persuade for your current level. Even if you over leveled the content or, you know, like, it doesn't matter. It's, it's basically, if we were level 23 when doing this check, it would be an easier check than if we're level 30 when doing the check. So as I level up, I actually gets harder to pass this, but this, I'm glad I managed to pass this. This is worse items-wise, I'm pretty sure it's worse experience-wise, but, you know, I don't care. I don't want to have to kill Mona and Dante, even if Celeste has gone crazy. Cash of equipment, okay. Greetings to you. My greeting, my greet, my greetings to you. My greeting, my gr my greetings to you. Hello, hello, hello. Well met. Hello. Yeah, technically we're more dedicated to this than you are, Black, aren't we? Well, we'll take Robert along.
Wait, I thought they were supposed to remove the restriction on the companions. Terribly evil, right. Talk to the general, yep. A stone of recall, okay. Found it on the body of the soldiers. Well met. Okay then. Well met. Well met. Savant, we need to have words. I'm gonna have to send him a message. 